Your Excellency, um, President Islamic Republic of Pakistan, uh, Dr. Raza Bakir, Dr. Imran Ismail, Dr. Ishrat Hussain, Dr. Shamchar Dakhtar, and distinguished guests, Assalamu alaikum. It's indeed a privilege to be a part of this uh, August gathering. Uh, I'd like to acknowledge Pakistan Observer for organizing this conference and actively supporting the cause of Islamic banking in Pakistan. Uh, we all know that it has been the desire of uh, the government and State Bank of Pakistan to try and uh, steadily transform our uh, conventional banking system to Islamic banking. In this regard, I'd like to take this opportunity to share our experience of Faisal Bank's successful conversion efforts to transform from a conventional bank to an Islamic bank to be completed, inshallah, by the middle of next year. This model could re readily be used by our banking industry for transformation of conventional banks and or their branches through an Islamic uh, subsidiary model. Our conversion model is uh, being recognized for its comprehensiveness based on uh, the success in possibly one of the largest conversions of a conventional bank to an Islamic bank on a global basis. The conversion has really been a collaborative effort, uh, a journey of uh, belief, planning, commitment, and dedication, supported all the way by our sponsors, State Bank of Pakistan, um, Ulama's Sharia Board, our employees, and above all, our customers. Uh, we did not have any idea uh, or even an example of such conversion efforts to transform an active conventional bank uh, to a full-fledged Islamic bank. Initially, the thought process was that it will be easy and will be managed in 18 to 24 months. However, it was not that uh, simple. The priority was given to embark upon a responsible and a well-structured conversion plan whereby we could uh, protect the interest of all stakeholders uh, with foremost importance given to our customers and stability of the franchise. It envisaged a complete revamp in systems, processes, procedures, product suite, brand, and above all, the human transformation. The initial few years were uh, spent uh, with an inward focus, concentrating on proce procedures, process trainings, and product transformation with couple with plans for brand transformation towards an Islamic bank. Brand transformation's requirements were met through a new Islamic identity, coupled with an active marketing campaign. Uh, then started the most difficult phase of the transformation, uh, the conversion of human mindset, our employee base, who were all trained and adept in conventional banking. It was indeed extremely challenging and required some deep inspiration at all levels to motivate them to come out of the comfort zone and move towards Islamic banking. We ensured intensive trainings uh, on Islamic banking for our staff, focusing mainly on the concept of faith-driven Islamic banking being a preferred choice for livelihood for themselves and their families. It was really encouraging to see that how the customers welcomed and adapted to Islamic banking as a preferred choice. We really focused on customer-centric approach to ensure availability of a full suite of Islamic products coupled with awareness sessions for them. We have so far converted thousands of customers spread in hundreds of our branches across the country. MashaAllah, our successful conversion um, will hopefully work as a model leading towards the ultimate destination of transforming our banking sector towards Islamic banking. It also reinforces the industry and state bank estimates on the huge potential of Islamic banking industry and acceptability of Islamic banking with our masses, which will also translate into increased financial inclusion, inshallah. On an overall basis, uh, state banks' continued fo focus on Islamic banking is indeed commendable, as it has uh, issued detailed guidelines and a proper framework on conversion and has also set Islamic banking growth targets in its recent five-year strategic plan for Islamic banking. I must acknowledge that our efforts of transformation have been fully supported by the State Bank's Islamic banking team, led by Mr. G.M. Abbasi, both with, as our regulators and more so um, as our partners in the entire journey. I hope that we are able to create this model, which would be, inshallah, used by other banks in future. Thank you. This is Pakistan Observer. Visit our YouTube channel for more informative video.